This is Christopher from St. Louis. When were we looking into the cosmos for possible Dyson spheres? What criteria are we using to tell the difference between a Dyson sphere and something else? Let me get that Dyson sphere out of your mind right now. All right. All right, because I did a little calculation, Mm -hmm. right? Basically, you're not going to have enough matter to build a Dyson sphere. If you took all of Jupiter and you try to make a Dyson sphere around the sun using all of it, the idea is that that matter, that's like taking a human eyeball and trying to make a sphere around a basketball using that material. So you're trying to harness the energy of a star you're using to absorb, this artificial... You're trying to absorb it in matter, right? And then convert it to useful energy, like, right? right? And so you do not have enough matter in the solar system... To create something To create larger. something that you could put around because the sun. Because it's not large enough or because it can't hold... Because it's not large. It's, not, it's like... The stars are so much bigger than their planet. Right. If you had that much material... <laughs> it means you're visiting other star systems. Why would you be right. wasting it? This is not even an interesting what? exercise. You don't, need, you don't right. even need it at that <laughs> it's point. Like, what are you trying? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. You know, you're we scooping more... up thousand the planets of a thousand solar systems to get the energy right. from one Create star. Right. Right. What the hell are you 